Hi guys, this tutorial here is covering 360 images in Home Inspector Pro. Uh, this feature was added in Home Inspector Pro 6. So I have Home Inspector Pro open. Uh, I've gone to the Photos page, Add Review Photos, and there's an icon here on the far right that is for 360 images. Do not try to insert 360 images using the normal image button. You'll just get a flat uh, JPEG image. It won't have the, the 360 feature in it. So what I'm going to do is click on the 360 and within my images, I'm going to select a couple images that are 360 images that I previously took. And I'm going to insert them. I've already uh, insert them into interior, you know, walls just to um, make this simple. Let's say we're both looking at wall condition here. And I'm going to go ahead and first generate the report so you can see what this looks like inside of a PDF. All right, I'm gonna scroll down to our interior areas. And you'll see here we have our two 360s, uh, one here, one right here. Um, the only reason I didn't put two on one page is they're so tall it doesn't fit. Now notice one of the things we did with the 360 images is even within the report, we have it set to go the full width. Uh, 360s are typically like a panoramic image and so instead of trying to make it into a small little box, um, even at first glance, the, the client is able to see a lot more than this. Now, the PDF in the web-based HTML version of the report do show slightly differently. Um, when I click on this 360 image, it pops up and it gives us the slice of this image large. And then there's little left and right arrow buttons here that the client can then use to scroll through and look at the whole image larger. And I can click and do, this, oops, do the same thing with the next one as well. That way the client really can get a close up and they can really um, look around that image. And now I'll show you what this looks like in the PDF version, or sorry, in the web-based HTML version of the report as well. Okay, I'm gonna upload the report to HIP Office. This could also be done to HIP Cloud or to ISN. Shows me the order number. Um, the important thing is up uploading an HTML format. 360 image. It's going to generate the PDF first because it's sending the PDF and the web-based version of the report up to uh, the cloud for the clients. Okay. The report has been successfully created. I'm now gonna go log into HIP Office to take a quick look at this report. All right, in HIP Office, I got the order number up. I'm gonna to go to reports and I have the report right here. So this would show me the PDF version, which we already looked at. This is gonna show me the web-based version. And with any of the PDFs, you can be in continuous mode or you can do a new page. I'm gonna scroll down to the 360 images. And now again, if the client clicks on it, it brings it up much larger and you can pan, or the client can pan up and down, left and right, just simply by clicking and grabbing and then dragging around. Click again, it shrinks down. I can go to the next 360 image and do the exact same thing. So if you do a, a single 360 shot in each room, this will give your client the ability to really look around uh, each room. And this is ex especially important or useful if you have out-of-town buyers, you have military relocations and stuff like that. If you have any questions on how 360 images work, please feel free to uh, email us, help at homeinspectorpro.com. You can give us a call at 888-750-4777 or just click on live chat on our website. Thank you.